how to compose music faster for stock libraries. Tip number one, compose music that you're good at, music that is close to your heart. So if you are a hip hop producer, then you should focus on hip hop. If you are a guitarist like myself, you should focus on guitar music. I am a guitarist, so I compose anything from pop rock, rock music, corporate music, acoustic music, Folk music is by far my best selling tracks across all libraries. And for me to compose a music track just using my guitar is something that I can do very, very quickly. So that's by far the best way to compose music fast. There's a lot of problem with newcomers in music licensing. The main problem that they have is that they're looking around to what other people are doing and they are ignoring what they are good at, their major strengths. So never look around and see what others are doing and try to copy them. Just be authentic to yourself, know what your strengths are and embrace it. Number two, commit to a schedule. Now we are all busy. We have different responsibilities. You need to commit though to a schedule. All you need is an hour. Give yourself an hour, time yourself for one hour and see what can you come up with. If you do this, you will realize very quickly that you can be very productive with just one hour. Try to put as much as possible into that one hour. You should be able to compose something, even a rough demo of an intro, a verse and a chorus, a main idea with a melody and chord progression and rhythm in that hour. If you're not doing it, it's because you still have problems navigating your way around your DAW and you need to put time and practice in that. You don't know really about composition. You really have too many ideas, but you don't really know how to put them down, to put it into a concrete musical idea. Or number three, you are overqualified and you just cannot accept that music for stock libraries is very, very simple. I was guilty of the third one. Overqualified, I knew about music production, I knew everything about music, and here I am trying to make this more complicated than it actually is. And the reality is that it is very, very simple. And that's what's hard because you need to hold back. You need to really put everything that is needed for the music, but don't put more than is actually needed. And that's where you need to leave your ego outside of the composition and really just focus on what works for the marketplace. You need to start thinking like your clients. They're not composing music for you. You're composing music in the service of somebody else's product. And number three, don't wait for inspiration. Inspiration will let you down. I am a true believer that writer's block does not exist. Writer's blocks is just an excuse that we find in order to attain perfection, in order to say, I'm not feeling it. I need to wait for the muse. In my experience over the years, I find that inspiration comes afterwards. Inspiration comes once I start working on my music, once I open the door, once I put the chords down. It might seem a little bit mechanical, and it might seem a little bit cold, but it's the truth. If you wait for inspiration, it's gonna take a long time for inspiration to come to you. And if you depend on outside forces for inspiration, then good luck to you as well for that. I think that the best way is to commit to a schedule, sit down, then just put down those two notes, those three chords, and just commit to a tempo, commit to a style earlier on. And if the idea is bad in the beginning, that's great. Make the bad idea good. That is your challenge as a stock music composer. I hope this video finds you well. I hope these three tips help you produce music faster, quicker than never before, because one of the things that is gonna be a key factor for you to produce a lot of music and have a lot of output is to make a lot. And you cannot get to quality if you don't have the quantity. This is another conversation as well for another video, and I have spoken about this as well. A lot of people in music licensing talk about that it's better to have quality instead of quantity. I disagree completely. You cannot have quality if you don't have quantity. And in order to get to the quality, you have to get a lot of quantity out there and you need to get rid of those bad ideas. And the only way to get rid of those bad ideas is by composing a lot of music. I hope this video finds you well. Go to my website, stockmusiclicensing.com slash start to get started if you're a beginner or if, even if you are an experienced composer but you're not experiencing any sales and no success whatsoever with your music, go to my website again and download free resources there to get you started or to get you going. Thank you so much for all the love and support. And as always, rock and roll, and here's to your success.